currently, our new hot product is our hand sanitizer. We typically make vodka, gin, we make rum, whiskey, and some specialty spirits. Provide for our community came as a result of the whole coronavirus situation. Here you go. Thank you so much. We offer it free of charge for people to come in with their own bottles. We'll fill it up for them. They can use it as needed, give it out to their friends and family. This was something that came as a result of just the current circumstances. Our traditional model as a business is obviously shut down where we can't do on-premise uh, consumption. But we've got the capability and the ability to produce ethyl alcohol at high percentages, which is required to make sanitizer and do the right thing and help out the community. We have all the resources that we needed to do it, so it really wasn't too much of a stretch for us to just kind of redirect where we were putting things to make our house-made sanitizer. So this is uh, about 68% alcohol. Um, as you can see, it's flammable um, to show that it's effective. So this here is our still. It's about 2,250 liters. It's one of the largest stills, if not the largest, in Pennsylvania. Instead of portioning out neutral ethanol to become vodka or to become gin, we just set it aside and, and treated it a little differently, added some different ingredients to it to make it the hand sanitizer. We've got our own lab where we can run analysis that we are producing something that is going to be sanitary. Our process takes about 11 to 12 hours to collect a final volume of about 425 to 450 liters at 95% alcohol. We got our formula for making the hand sanitizer from the World Health Organization's website. This ethanol has already been diluted down to about 72% alcohol. We use a vegetable-based glycerin. The purpose of this is to increase the viscosity so you can spread it around your hands better. And then we'll finish that off with some hydrogen peroxide, which helps with the sanitation purposes. We basically have a tank filled up back there, and as folks come in, preferably with their own containers, we fill it up free of charge. And right now we're doing it from 12 to 1 p.m and then from 5 to 6 p.m. And we are open until 7 o'clock, uh, Monday through Friday. And we're just trying to do what we can to soften the blow, if you will, to the business, but also the community. Five liters of hand sanitizer for you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. The community response has been significant. We even had a police department give us a call earlier today asking for sanitizer, which we gave to them free of charge so they can use with the forces they're out and about. People really seem to appreciate what we're doing.